practical network storage solutions that are also suitable for backups, media streaming, and more. We'll show you the best NAS enclosures currently on the market. For this, we've evaluated tests and opinions and added them up to an overall score. There are many different options to consider, both for preference and budget. NAS enclosures are NAS systems that still require hard drives to be installed for commissioning. For advanced users, they are preferable to ready-made devices with hard drives. Since you can decide individually which hard drives are needed and how much capacity the system should offer. Moreover, NAS empty enclosures also allow older and unused hard disks to be put to a new use. Before we get to the ranking, I would like to ask you, if you like the video so far, to leave a like, or tell us in the comments what we should do better. And while you're at it, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and click the notification bell. Then you won't miss any of our upcoming comparisons. Also, consider checking out our other videos. We have many other different comparison videos for you to consider. And now here comes the ranking. We are beginning with the best seller, the Synology DS918 Plus. Approximately $650. In the overall result of all test magazines, we come to an overall score of 4.9 out of 5 stars. The customer rating is 4.7 out of 5 stars. The Synology DS918 Plus offers enough performance for demanding home users and small businesses for just over $600. US dollars. The significant surcharge compared to a solution with only two hard drive bays does not only result from the now four bays. Above all, the DS918 Plus can be configured much more flexibly. Depending on your needs, you can accelerate the hard disk accesses with up to two SDDs, expand the already generous four gigabytes of RAM to up to eight gigabytes, and even increase the number of bays from four to nine. For this, an additional device is connected to the NAS, the Synology DX517. On top of that, there is an Intel CPU, Intel Celeron J3455, quad-core with up to 2.3 GHz, in the DS918+, Plus, which allows running virtual machines on the NAS. This allows you to run Windows or an additional Linux on the NAS. For example, this can be useful for home automation or for running an enterprise resource planning system. In the home, the DS918 Plus makes itself useful as a video platform. It transcodes 4K videos at up to 30 frames per second via hardware. So the rest of the NAS's performance is not significantly affected by video streaming. Up to 56 terabytes of storage space, four drives of 14 terabytes each, provide enough breathing room for even larger video collections. Another interesting factor is the possibility to use the BTRF's file system, which offers admins practical additional functions. Among other things, they can use the snapshot function to save the contents of drives at any time, and conveniently return to them later. With the variety of functions and more drives, however, the power consumption of the NAS also increases. According to the manufacturer, the Synology DS918 Plus requires 12.6 watts in idle mode and around 29 watts when accessed. By the way, Synology specifies the maximum read and write speeds with 225 and 221 megabytes per second, respectively. The Synology DS918 Plus 4 bay desktop NAS enclosure has received an average rating of 4.6 out of 5 stars from over 340 Amazon reviewers. They praise its generous storage space and feature set. Connected via just one of its two network ports, the DS981 Plus's speed settles at 110 to 120 megabytes per second in practice. For more, it needs a second network cable and a network switch that supports link aggregation. In quiet environments, the fans are audible. However, in our experience, you won't be able to completely quiet a NAS with four humming hard drives at once. The Intel CPU's performance is sufficient for simple virtualizations, but it quickly runs out of steam for complex requirements. By the way, just a friendly reminder, we have all the relevant links below in the video description for more details. And up next, the price performance winner. 
the Western Digital MyCloud EX2 Ultra. Approximately $150. In the overall result of all test magazines, we arrive at a total score of 4 out of 5 stars. The customer rating is 4.3 out of 5 stars. With enough computing power for multiple parallel access and smooth streaming, the Western Digital MyCloud EX2 Ultra NAS system is aimed at home users who want to offer a central storage point for everyone in the household. Against data loss, the possibility to build a RAID system can protect quite effectively. Because of the good processor and RAM, encryption does not slow down access to the data too much either. Equipped with Gigabit LAN, values of over 100 megabytes per second are achieved during communication with the home network. Multiple HD streaming is thus possible. The NAS server can be used as a private cloud with the corresponding software which partly requires a registration with Western Digital. Apps for the smartphone then allow access from everywhere. And two USB 3.0 ports are directly available for backing up or quickly exchanging data, for example. The power saving functions are very practical. By creating a schedule, the device can shut down independently at night, for example, depending on requirements. For a simple storage solution in one's own network, the $150 US dollar listing on Amazon would be too much. However, since the NAS system from Western Digital offers encryption, allows fast access via LAN, and has a decent hardware configuration, the investment is absolutely understandable. Especially when several people use it at the same time, it can be utilized with ease. And as we said before, we have all the relevant links below in the video description if you require any more details. Also keep in mind we have many other comparison videos for you to consider, so perhaps take a look after this video if you're interested. And up next we have our comparison winner, the Synology DS220 Plus, about 350 US dollars. In the overall result of all test magazines, we come to an overall score of 4.4 out of 5 stars. The customer rating is even higher at 4.7 out of 5 stars. The top NAS goes into the next round. Strengths Very low power consumption Two LAN ports for link aggregation Mature operating system with many applications and good speed. Weaknesses Only 2 GB of RAM The DS220 Plus replaces the tired and tested DS218 Plus, which is popular with testers. The two-bay NAS is intended for ambitious private users, but also cuts a good figure in smaller offices or companies. The pricing with prices around $350 US dollars seems fair in view of the huge feature set. A new feature is a second LAN port, which can be used for link aggregation. The second cable connection optimizes the data throughput, but this only becomes important when there is a lot of data traffic. The new chipset is on a similarly good performance level as the DS218+, Plus, but is much more energy efficient. Since there is only 2GB of RAM, extensive virtualization is hardly possible. The popular Synology operating system is also used here, and scores with an outstanding feature set, including App Store, as always. Our conclusion? Of course, every device has its own strengths and weaknesses. So everyone should decide for themselves which NAS best server suits them, their needs, and their wallet. If you need any further details, we have the links for all the devices in the video in the video description below. Have you already decided, or do you already have one of these devices at home? Then we would be happy if you let us know which device you prefer, and above all why. I hope that we could help you a bit deciding on your purchase, and maybe you can tell us in the comments which product you like best and which one you might have already decided on. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel and click on the notification bell. That would really help us and the channel. And as we said before, we have many other video comparisons for you to consider, so if you're interested, make sure you check those out. Thanks for watching, and see you very soon. Goodbye.